Okay, I'm a German former member of parliament and I was member of parliament for 29 years. Within these 29 years, I have made a number of visits into the Soviet Union and into the Russia which existed afterwards. And my special region was the Southern Caucasus, Karabakh, Armenia, Azerbaijan, but also because traveling there meant that I had to go to Tbilisi occasionally and we made conferences for some time. So, as a member of parliament, I was responsible for special relations to Southern Caucasus. Under these conditions, I had to do with the conflict, meeting Abkhazian problems in Abkhazia too. So, this time I'm here in Abkhazia for the second time. When I was here before, it was in the beginning 90s, I think, and uh, I met German soldiers here who were doctors of medicine and it served an international purpose of keeping peace in Abkhazia, which was a difficult thing. Uh, but uh, what happened then had not much to do with uh, Abkhazia in, in the following years. We asked sometimes Abkhazians to visit us, but uh, it did not work out. But we were always interested in getting Abkhazian interests related to other parts of Europe. And we wanted Abkhazians to talk about their situation, which they found at whatever time they were living then, they found for their future life. And there we found quite a number of difficulties which came out of the situation that Abkhazia was supposed to be part of Georgia. But Abkhazians did not necessarily like this situation because their treatment in Georgia had not been very good for them all the time. This was different for different persons, but it was bad for some persons too. And they wanted another relationship inside the Southern Caucasus and inside Georgia if they had to stay in Georgia or outside of Georgia and organize relations to the others. So that is something we are interested in today. If we look into Abkhazia today, we find friendly population, we find uh, people who are sometimes in need of relations to other European countries. They want to see hospitals in other countries with specialists working in certain fields of health. Uh, and keeping health meant then going into other hospitals. This happened to a Georgian president to former time too. And if we look at this situation, we think there should be openness for Abkhazians to travel into other countries that there should be no formal difficulties as far as passport papers and uh, uh, other papers are concerned in order to be treated. And this means not only treatment of people who are sick and want to go to hospital, it's uh, something which might be interesting for people who study at universities. So students should be uh, able to go into other countries and study there for one year if they have a chance uh, for getting subsidies for such purposes, scholarships, as, as it is called. So I think we should try and find for Abkhazians new situations to deal with their formal difficulties. And uh, about this we will try to start a discussion in my home country, Germany, too, in order to have a new arrangement found for dealing with Abkhazian citizens of what age and in which situation, whatever, personally, so that this situation will no longer be, be a problem on the formal side of papers and passports.